pounds. I didn't intend to go 13 pounds. 12 to 1? Crush. On 93. 93. That, oh, but, 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 just so everybody's clear. No booster. Yeah, just so everybody's clear, that wasn't what we, that wasn't what they intended, it wasn't what we intended, it's just what it did. That's how accidents happen. Problem? We think. Yes, Possibly. It's out. It's gotta be. Yeah, that spark oil, look at that. Yeah, we're, they were blowing out, so. Yeah. <laughs> Mo power. Mo power, man. What are you doing down there, Ken? I'm, I'm You're fixing your broken car. turbo car? Hey, we were 9.8 pounds. We were going somewhere. And then it broke. Last time I saw it was in like a million pieces. You put 550 in it, right? 10 quart? Looks like you gotta adjust the tips back here a little bit. They stick them way out. Did you guys hit boost it all the way up here? A little bit. I think three pounds is the most it let us. Baby boost. Yeah. yeah. So it feels like it has a hiccup a lot. So if it starts doing anything stupid. Okay. I see it. It's actually a good spot. That is uh, passenger weight, passenger bottom wastegate, passenger top wastegate, boost controller, blow Which off is out, top of your wastegate. And then this goes to the inside. Gotcha. Camped off these. You took the thing out of this, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Sweet. This is a Hell Horse performance kit. Same one I got. You saw lots of positive knock. I mean, I'm just kidding. Yeah, he's still got a little cleaning up to do. This is very last minute. You're going to try to bring him back uh, in? My exhaust tips. Yeah. I had to do the same thing to mine. I had to yeah. cut up the, uh, the exhaust a little bit. The mid pipes, the lead pipes coming off the back of the, uh, the down uh, pipes. Pretty yeah. common. So we're going to make a thousand today at 93? No. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Why not? Come on. Yeah, in about two weeks, man, you're gonna be like, <gasps> well, I drive my it sounds so today. good. Well, I'm not gonna start it up there uh, under, uh, under the car. Yeah, give them a couple weeks and it'll really sound like a turbo. Nice. Say break in. I got helmet hair right up here on the bike. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are here with Ken Speed Out of 731. He's finally, finally got his twin turbo kit from hell horse installed here on the dyno very first time going to see what this thing is going to do on 93. he put a booster in it and he boosted the thing no just straight 93. you better hope it but yeah hopefully it's good 93. i don't know if he's going to go too crazy with it but we'll see how far he goes but wish us luck i'm going to here to make some power see what it does same turbo kit that i'm running guys if you're interested in all in this turbo kit mine makes a serious amount of power this thing is about to hell horse performance check them out links down below to save you some money a bunch of money off if you want to boost your car if you missed the last videos where we did kind of a layout uh, this kit is a little bit more revised than mine the gloss black finish here completely different charge piping um, a couple of revisions he's got a smaller turbo it's a twin 6365 right 6365. 6365. I have twin 6467s, but the cool thing about his also is that the turbine has a whole different design. It's lighter, the fins are completely different, so it's supposed to spool a little quicker and uh, blow about 30% more. Velocity Blue looks so good. Looks so, so delicious. Go fast pitch controller. We'll make us uh, some power. Speed at 731. Same thing like we did on the GT350. If you see positive knot, go ahead and let out and we'll send a log. All right. If you see negative, everything's happy. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, gonna watch the I'm boost. Gonna watch it boost. shouldn't get over eight, eight and a half. Yeah, it's just a uh, wastegate hit. Wastegate seven, so it should. 25 to 65. <laughs> Didn't hit white skate pressure. 5.4 pounds. 5.4? Yeah. Uh, 551. 551 and 480. And 480 torque. That's on 5-ish pounds. We gotta figure, we gotta look at that and make sure. We're That's good. not bad for five pounds, bro, though. Yeah, we gotta figure out, we should be at seven. Yeah. So it's something we gotta look at. Yeah, white skate, you got seven pounds of spring, so it should be able to hit Six and a half to seven and a half on the, the wastegate gauge springs. All right, round two, same test, up the gain, and we're gonna go to 7,500 and uh, retighten some clamps. So hopefully, that's a better look. Five 
point six. There's no way you're consistently bleeding off two pounds. No, it'd have to be a big boost leak. Well, I mean, you're not gonna be consistent on it either. Right. Six eighty six five eighty torque. It peaked nine point eight and dropped down to about nine three. Yeah, so way down by the turbo down there mm -hmm. for the outside for the outside of there it blew off. The chart the well, we was making nine point eight pounds. Remember, we? remember when we did mine the first time and the charge pipe went bop. Yeah, that was crazy. All right, and they were tight, man. We was nine point eight pounds. All of a sudden, it was like I was like, oh, oh. Yeah, I saw his finger point up. I was like, oh my god. Well, he pointed at the engine, man. I got scared. What are you doing down there, Ken? I'm. I'm You're fixing your broken car. turbo car. Hey, we were nine point eight pounds. We were going somewhere. And then it broke. Knock on wood. You know what I mean? Trying to hit ten pounds. But he was on his way to make 700. Oh, she had 10 pounds? Uh, a little over nine. A little over nine. Ah, uh, made less. 664, 570. Another clean hit. It did uh, 674 at 578, but the break, uh, yeah, 9.4 was the peak and it did not break up at the top. So interesting. This is a, like the first, yeah. around nine pounds is like the first yeah, clean hit yeah. so far. Congratulations, you've made it to this point in the video. Thank you for sticking around. But now is the time. This is what you've all been waiting for. It's time to turn it up. So gain is set to 100, duty cycle 85. About to make some power. Let's do it. Tell the story. Yeah, we're going, we're, we don't want to run. That's that's pretty good numbers though. Yeah. Seven forty. If we would, we turn the boost down a little bit and they're able to rev it out, it'll probably be the same. Yes, that is correct. And it's safe. It is safe. Guys. Yes. Thirteen pounds. Yeah. Thirteen pounds. I didn't intend to go thirteen pounds. Twelve to one. Fresh. On oh, ninety three. Ninety three. That. Okay. But but but. Just so everybody's clear. No booster. Just so everybody's clear, that wasn't what we, that wasn't what they intended, it wasn't what we intended, it's just what it did. That's how accidents happen. 85, 85 duty cycle. cycle. He had gained it a 100, so he's trying to, to have them ramp in as fast as possible. I didn't do that though. Sen yeah, they why, did. I know, that's what they did. <laughs> sensitivity is left alone. Um, sensitivity might clean up some of the lines a little bit, but guys that are afraid of like turbo lag, um, you don't really have to worry about it, especially at the track, you're gonna be launching up high anyway off the foot brake so very quickly this thing is going to move out very excited to see that content check them out there will be a race coming between my car and his who's going to reign champ to be determined at a later date but really cool comparison i think because again the turbo kits are the same the only difference is 63 65s for him 64 67 for me i am on the 85 he's going to get there but 750 horsepower, 93 octane, 13 pounds of boost. Get to tear apart this data log real quick, make sure everything looks good. Probably make another hit. If not, 
pretty respectable, man. You cannot argue. Very, very respectable. Yeah, we do too, but he keeps on going all the way across yeah. in there. We're up to 80, 79, counting backwards again, down to 77. <laughs> to do with this or not does he need valve springs i don't know i did but for it 93 odd saying you run into detonation uh you can we haven't seen any of that today it's all been negative knock which is good what happened that sounds like a spark blowout that spark like blowout that, that sounds like spark blowout that's the guy come on sound when it did it yeah problem we think yes, possibly it's out. It's gotta be yeah that's spark blowout look at that yeah we think we're blowing out so yeah so we're gonna get them tighter we're gonna go a little tighter and uh, 24. 22. Let's go 22. Too much gap. That's gonna be the problem. You're about to see some more power when we fix this. We got plugs. Correct gap. So, about to see a dramatic change in horsepower, I think. science experiment drop the exhaust you haven't seen it already look at this see how they actually sit above the subframe so if you had like a helium kit for example you'd have a um you'd have like an oil sump right here you actually sit a little bit below the subframe everything is tucked up it's all oilless you just have coolant lines that are tied into your factory setup so you just cool them off with you cool it from the car and then Zerk fittings here, there, every 3,000 miles, hit them with about six or seven scorch of the five temperature degrees, which is proprietary to Comp Turbo, but that's how you maintain these guys. But they are gorgeous. Let's go make some turbo noises now. We made 767, 85% cycle, but it broke up. Now we're going to try to see just appeasing. You hear it? You hear it? What'd you say? On three. <laughs> On three is where it's at. a full three inch but this is your restriction so proven now if we delete or i'm sorry upgrade this to a full three inch which he's going to do that is the result 80 percent duty cycle let's go it for my video hopefully you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up if you did subscribe because we have a race coming my car versus this one but pretty impressive 13 pounds of boost almost 800 horsepower there is still some revision to be made so 
that will be corrected off camera. Uh, they want to, Rob Shoemaker, Palm Beach China wants to make this thing fly. I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, have a great day. Stay safe. Love your families. Pet your dogs and your cats. And I'm tired and I'm going to go to bed. See you later. Woo! Sounds good. She sounds mighty sexy. Thank you.